Okay. We'll see. This is the last try. Third time I start the stream. If it still doesn't do it, then we done streaming for the day. And I'll be back next week because we have starting arriving today, I believe. And the existing ISP can suck my sweet ass with its bullshit. I restarted a year out of three times now. Three times the Steam restarted. Uh, the stream, rather. I'm over it. Very much over it. I mean, only streaming at 6 max. It's not even crazy. I'm supposed to stream at 13. Anyway, we'll see. <clears throat> How we do? So far, looking quite good. So what we want is... Chance per rank to find body armor. Yeah, I want to have body armor. I want to have... I want to find Exanginus. <coughs> Exanginus. I also need the other lens that it removes dungeons and shit, but whatever. We want to have Exanginus with LP on it. Um, Death of Emperor of Corpses, 209 corruption for one body armor. That's a very bad prophecy. It's very bad. 110 corruption. Four body armor. Emperor of Corpses again. This is going to be very late, but whatever, we'll do it. Lagon on 250 corruption? Nope. Why are these so ass? There it is. Deaths of Siege Golem. That's very doable. Pro Sanctum tier 2. Unique body armor times 5. That's a good one. Any dungeon tier 4. Actually, kind of want to have both, but this one's better because I'm going to run a temporal anyway. The suck, huh? I mean, Exalted Armor might also be good. Exiled Mage. I get this three times, yeah. Because we, of course, want to slap something on them. And I'm lacking a little bit on these. Emperor of Corpses, every time he drops all the thingies, huh? 110 corruption. This is a while until I get to that. That's the problem. Why are they all with such high corruption? Whatever. He also drops good sword, so it's not, not a bad thing. The Age of Winter, Death of Herod. That is a campaign, isn't it? No, it's not. Just killing Hero. Okay, that's good. We can do this. Jura. Oh, yes. Five times jam. She's going to drop a lot once we kill her. So far, Bastion. I'm gonna run this as well, so it's fine. Do I really want to spend all the favor? Abomination. I can fulfill this eight times, so that's eight unique body armors with sixteen Weaver's Will. I don't think Exanctionists can ever have Weaver's Will, right? I think, but it's not a bad prophecy to have. Exiled Mage. Prosic for Moses. This is a good one. I just killed him though, but whatever. Any dungeon, rare enemy. Tier 3. Three times. We're gonna run dungeons. I mean, that's enough, I think. Enough prophecies. Oh, yeah, I gotta talk to him. Prophecies. When do I get to... Damn, that's a lot. I need to I need to play some more, huh? So now we gotta go... Yeah, down here. <sighs> See if we finally fixed our problems. The streaming quality will suffer a little, a little slight bit because of it. Because I have to stream at a maximum of six mags. 
so far YouTube seems to be satisfied with it. Even though I stream at half the bitrate I should. But oh well. I think we finally somewhat got it going on. Oh, it's fixed now. Dude, this shit pisses me off. Mm -hmm. Do some good damage with just right clicking them. We also take a lot of damage from these guys. So, even though we do 3,500 damage with the Harvest, you're dead. We still need to work with our spells a lot. Get over here, friends. Looks like trouble. I just gained so much health from the Fissure. Otherwise, I would have died. was damned. But the main idea we're playing here, I don't even need to kill this guy by the way. Let's do it. Let's kill his ass. I just clicked the thing but whatever. <clears throat> yeah we got the insane boots. Oh shit, hold up. Hold up. I got these. 12 intelligence, strength, dexterity, increased bleed duration, physical aim and damage to moving enemies. Okay, that's fine, but movement speed as well. This one is insane. Insanely good for us. So, yeah. <clears throat> I just randomly found this in my stash. I didn't even know I have it. Uh oh. Oh, but not lagging. I was just missing. These do so much damage, these guys. It's kind of good. You're not going anywhere. Very visually appealing that build. I actually have to go here. I believe. Yeah, get over here, bitch. So what you want to do is you want to cast your fissure. Actually, you want to cast your spirit plague first on an enemy, then cast your fissure, then the profane veil, because it buffs your curses. Like while I'm in profane veil, my curses get a buff. Do more damage. It's basically the build we're running here. You don't always have to go for all of it. You can also just right click to harvest. Like the profane veil itself, as you can tell, doesn't do much damage. But it also doesn't have to. It's mostly to evade damage. And buff the curses, of course. Isn't there usually a mage over here? That's weird. I'll tear you apart! It's come. It's come! She's so happy about it. Ow. Okay. Also, Spirit Plague does do a lot of damage. I wish there would be an effect. So Spirit Blake is applied automatically. That would be insane. Like by, I don't know, casting Fissure or whatever. To automatically also cast. Because um, Fissure also casts my Harvest. Pretty neat. Let's trade them out. So you want to group your enemies. 
like kite them around until they attack you. Can I help? Until try to stop me. Super easy kill. I saw a video of someone actually paying the price. And that's all it did. It just he just let you through for 100k. There was nothing crazy about it. It was just all it, all it was. And I was like, why would you do that? Just kill him. Even gives you XP, you know? Oh, wrong, wrong button. My poison resistance seems to be good, huh? Yeah, 67. Physicals ass. Okay, we gotta work on resistances, man. This is all bullshit. This is why we die so fast. I probably might wanna exchange some items, some uniques. I just realized I'm running only uniques and legendaries except for this one. <laughs> Cheap build. I mean, you don't have to run these. It's just because I wanna level fast. It's also the thing people don't realize and took me a while to realize. Only running uniques isn't even always the best play. Because they usually focus on damage. But you lack resistances a lot if you do that. That is not always the best idea. Your death has come. See how I buffed my Spirit Plague? Did a lot of damage. Holy damn. Shush. It wasn't even worth to go in here, honestly, but I have to. Annoyingly. Yeah, friends, get over here. Come with me. I mean, you can run the go- Ooh, I just clicked. Just clicked potion. Fuck me. Holy damage! These guys are insane. We gotta work on also our build here a little bit. Why is my ward so shitty? I think I should have way more ward retention. I mean, I have no resistances whatsoever, and that's of course a problem. What brings you here? You never have anything good, do you? What brings you here? Damn. I have to play the combo as is. This guy over here. And he came back. I mean, you can spam Fissure quite quite a lot, actually. To Zerik. <laughs> How's my new? I never. <laughs> after you're done with your business, <laughs> you're this. I. What after that? <laughs> oh, come on. Where is that? Come on. Spirit? 
Yeah, the oasis. Can I go here right away? No, it's over here, right? Yeah. Hold up, before we go there. I want to see if we can exchange some damage for more resistances. Maybe the offhand. That's a lot of intelligence. First damage. This one, maybe. Spell that match. That's not even that good of an item. I will say that. And these all give us damage, no resistances. Elf. Minion stuff. We don't care about that. We sort them rings. Why does it not sort rings and amulets? Why not? Elf region. That doesn't do much. Poison resistance, necrotic resistance. Endurance was not bad actually. Necrotic damage. Physical resistance, oh yes. Fire damage, man. Elemental resistance is actually a good one. That's why I'm running this shit. We got a better rings here to help us. Resistance is elemental damage over time. Doesn't help me at all. Mean damage, human endurance threshold, physical resistance. Plus one to one attributes. This rest a lot strength with human avoidance. Why am I have this? It's not even a good. I mean, necrotic damage helps us, but. Physical resistance, fire damage, also useless. We could reroll that into a resistance. Do I have cold resistance anyway? Because this buffs us later a lot. Cold resistance. 55, huh? Feeling effectiveness. Elemental damage, attunement, spell damage, damage over time. I mean, spell damage is not bad. Watch rating. Yeah, Fizz res. and elemental resistance, and mana region. This one's a good one. Attunement, not so much. You want to reroll that? Doing something good. That's the best that could have happened, really. Let's roll this up. Oh shit, now I can't forge it. Damn it! I don't want damage, I need uh, resistances. In this case, I guess. Oh, we have physical a lot. I can't put resistances on the left, really? Damn, that sucks. Damage over time then would be good, I guess. Or spell damage. No, I think we go with dot. Because dot helps on bleed and everything. Oh shit, it doesn't even have fortune potential. Still better than the other shit, and we have resistance a little bit. Cold resistance. I like the endurance. Actually, doesn't it help me at all with low health? Not really. Chronic damage buffs our Kofonic and stuff. More Fizz res. Poison resistance, elemental resistance. That's good. Uh, fire damage is useless, so let's reroll. Cold resistance, at least. That's, that's nice. 
mental damage or no? I'm gonna go with just regular daughter. Shit, okay, we need need a higher level. These are not bad. We have a lot of physical actually we have physical resistance over capped. We have no void resistance whatsoever. That's bad against Jura. Lightning and cold could be better, but it's a start. It's it's a start, you know. We need this later. This doesn't do much. Neither does this. We throw these back in here. It's actually a twin item, isn't it? Yeah. How about some offhand? I can't run these. This has elemental resistance. Look at it. We kind of want to have this. But, well, it doesn't really help that much. Yeah, the belt also sucks. Chance of bleed on hit, that's, I guess, fine, but... Don't we have better ones? Damage, vault gain, and potion use? Need better belts, gentlemen. Go to belts. Minion damage. Run these for this Physical resistance. We have this maxed out pretty much. Right? I can't run most of these belts. What the fuck? Elemental resistance. Mana region health. This is a good one. Mana region, health region, lightning resistance. Okay. This rest, we don't need that. Cold resistance. One of our cold resistance maxed later, especially. Void resistance, poison, everything else sucks. Okay, so we have... What can we put on this one? Another prefix? Also a chance to find potions. It's just, just okay, you know? Physical damage I could throw there. No potion slots. I mean, physical damage would also help us a lot, because all our damage is physical. Yeah, that's the best one we can get here. Mana region, not really necessary. Kind of want to max out health, though. What? Did it ate up all my fortune potential? You did nothing, Glyph of Hope. You were useless. Anyway, it's better than that. This is what I meant earlier. Sometimes just running all the legendaries and stuff doesn't even help you that much. Sometimes uh, these ones are just better. So let me check. This is just crit. This is health, melee attack speed, health region. Health region is useless. Plus three to attributes, that's good though. This is good. Curl spell cast Peter. This is insane. We can slap some good things on that, I feel like. You wanna have health idols. Where do I find idols the best? Like insane health idols we need. We don't have better gloves, right? I guess we can turn Juras into good ones. Cold resistance. Let me actually check what they run in the build. They run frostbite shackles. We have ward, and it's just for the ward. Just for the ward, huh? Last House of the Living, I can't run this yet, but I can see why it's good. Oh yeah, and we need the Twisted Heart of U Ukeros. Where do I find this even? Last Epoch Tools. Epoch. Epoch. Twisted Heart. 
Reign of Dragons, of course. Emperor of Corpses. He has all the... Does Emperor of Corpses has really all the good stuff? Because let's, let's check for a second here. This is Emperor of Corpses. Rewards. This is good. Um, yeah, whatever. He has the Twisted Hall of Ukeros, which is insanely good. Symbol of Demise. I have this. It's kind of okay. But also this. Aperture of Frozen Light. Insane. Aurel is insane. Chronostas is insane. Dream Fawn. Very good. Not insane, but good. Humming Bee. Insane. Last Knife. Insane. Rainbow Edge. It's okay. Ghostmaker, I think, was also pretty good. Volcanus, very good. Fairyboss Chisel, very good. Uh, Bone Harm is still very good. Stormbreaker, Taste of Blood, very good. Tempest Maw, very good. Torch of the Pontifex, insane. The Surplus Mandate, not bad. Hakar's Phoenix, good. Uh, Undisputed, good. Very rare. Mortitus Reach, very good. Death's Embrace. Oh. Eye of Reen, very good. The Emperor of Corpses is the goat. He has all the good items, man. What the fuck? What a legend. What is this? 200 Axe, Unique Bone Scythe, Necronic Penetration. Necrotic melee damage, melee critical strength, movement. reduced bonus damage taken from critical strengths. Gain a stack of heroin claim when you use harvest and hit at least one enemy. Using harvest while at two stacks of heroin claim consumes them to perform grim harvest, granting 200% more melee damage, 100% increased area of effect. Wow. Current health consumed by grim harvest. Okay. Sadly, it is. All necrotic damage. That doesn't help me. I need physical. Yeah, are there any? This is an insane motherfucker. So let me check. Um, two-handed, whatever the fuck. I can't just search for two-handed. Physical damage. Why do I get this? Oh, physical damage taken as fire. You can't skull, I have this. Taking this physical damage, that's useless. Necronic damage, physical melee damage, spell physical damage of sacrifice. Physical melee, melee attack speed. Overkill damage leeches health. Because what did you actually run in the build? Just this. Vent of Configuration. I guess because of the 200% increased damage over time, physical damage, freezer rate. Yeah, the Omnis. We actually gotta even farm this. This is very good. But it's, this drops at 200 plus corruption from Orobis. Yeah. The duration. Plus 4 to Spirit Plague. Increased spell damage. Yeah, that's a good one. This, of course, is insane if you ever get to this. Heroin's just health, right? Yeah, usually. Always just health. I gotta find better. I gotta find. Better idols, man. I think we're good with this for now. I think we're Gucci. Can proceed. I mean, Emperor of Corpses, we have a lot of prophecies as well, though. So once we kick his ass be good mm. he's really the goat man he has all the good stuff so kill him more of but he's also a bitch to kill very annoying boss or difficult i should say 
I think it's also more difficult than Lagon, honestly. Lagon like, is just more tanky. But the Emperor, of course, does a lot of damage. Greek strike multiple. That's insane. Get over here, gentlemen. Wow, they got shredded by that harvest. Death will not take me. Oh, what is this? That was a mistake to do that. What is this bug? Renegade's will, huh? that's a shitty one. If this 15 times. I came back from the dead and he's dead again. This one damage over time, yeah. Do we have wall retention somewhere? Intelligence. This also buffs our damage around. Health. But damage leeches health. Well that's actually good, these two. I know we want to go into this anyway with the Lich, we also want to go for Ward granted. No, that's not it. Um, this is it. Wall retention. Yeah, the Lich has a bunch of good things as well. This one, I don't think we want to have. I might respect this. This one is good. Gas speed. Curses. Okay. All of them need more damage. And these three actually. These three. Ace. The rest of it we don't need that much. I feel like. Ranged enemies are a real problem. Why did this stun me? Bullshit. That is some bullshit. Just sad. Oh, I have no space for boots though. I think I have enough gold to buy another stash tag. Sure. Right. Ooh, idols. It's not just bad. It's okay, I guess, but not, not good. Very good. Damn, I almost died there. It's close. Tony, Kefani Fisher has no cooldown. Get over here, sun. There we are. Oh, I clicked out of the window for a second. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. I still don't know if the. I don't know, our ward um, scales up so slowly.
do take some damage and we're very close to death often, which is very annoying. Hello friends, how's it going? Sorry, just passing by, no worries. Just chilling, you know, nothing, nothing crazy. Your death has come. Your death has come. Ow, bitch. I'm electrifying. Not cool. A lot of shit just happened. They all dead. What the, what the damage? What the damage? These cunts, I hate them. That was so close, I just clicked in the right moment. We're always so low on our health. I mean, the endurance. What's our endurance threshold? 207. Yeah, actually, it goes low because we lose more health. Also, it's just 20%. Doesn't even do that much. <clears throat> but oh well. Hurrah! Alright, Zerik, let's do that again. Let's get this going. Our friend. <laughs> she don't, don't look at it. Trust me. Let's go thin their numbers a bit, shall we? Sure. Sure, buddy. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. Yeah, come to me, gentlemen. <laughs> Damn. Wait, where's... Holy damage, I shouldn't stay in these. And the rune threshold just saved my eyes there, huh? It appeared. It appears. I mean, the health of melee head does keep me alive a little bit. I will say that. But at the same time, I also think it makes my ward worse. How does this work exactly? I'll read through this in a second. Um, ten percent of current health lost per second. Gain this ward. You also have no armor, which is really nice. And it's per second. This is why sometimes we're just so low on health. I mean, it's more of a late game build, and I'm playing it early, so that's kind of the problem. But whatever. I died fast. Trying to fall off. Sure. Oh, he's still, he's still talking in the background. I think this one should be longer. This whole fight on the back of this. Whatever the fuck it is. Because it's always so fast, you know? 
We hit now the shittiest area in the entire game. We have to have to play. Sadly, but well, we have to do it. The temple rooftops. Absolutely annoying. And they got shredded. Ah, shit. I always keep running the wrong direction. This lane. You dare! Oh, oh. That was close. And because I misclicked, I wanted to teleport. So I had to quickly go into, into the thingy. Perish! Perish! Oh god, that's a lot of dudes. I didn't see what happened, but everyone died. Th that's what I saw. <laughs> Perish! Yeah, I think the gaining health actually hurts me. Because apparently as long as I lose health, I don't gain wall. Like not to the extent it should happen. Health getting kill might actually be bad for us. The health cannon kill is what makes this mostly. It helped early game, but I think now it's hurting me. I think we're gonna check this out later. Wait, where do I have to go? Oh, down here, right? Yeah, there it is. Perish! Like how, how happy she is about that. Oh shit. It's just a blur. It's just just everything explodes and that's it. More global damage to cursed while in profane whale. This I don't know if this is any good. It's a larger area. Immobilizes cursed enemies for a shorter reason. Okay. Duration. Duration. Increase area, more damage, more duration, movement speed, kill threshold with an axe. Interesting. Why would I do this? It's fire, heretics flame. This more damage. Mark for death. The secondary profane veil. This is good. Moves towards enemies. Higher mana cost. I don't know if I care about the mana cost. I think you want to test this. What's this? It's a shorter cooldown, but you can no longer change direction. Oh, it's a blink. Eh. Suits your minions. That's pointless. You gain wall plot dexterity when you dodge one in profane veil. That's not bad, actually. My dexterity is kind of high, 19, due to this great item. Oh shit, this one's not doing anything anyway. How about not be bad? Uh, we went the wrong direction again. Feels bad. Eat this. It's up here, isn't it? No, wait, I came. No, I didn't come. Perish! Yeah, we're in the right spot. Yeah, yeah. Good. That just gave me a lot of war, didn't it? How did I lose so much water? 
900% freeze rate. What the hell? Is there an item that gives you ward on attack? I don't think so, right? That would be nice. Perish. Stop blocking me. Holy. I just clicked. I just clicked Profane Veil. And I was done. Shouldn't have died there. Perish. Perish. I eat this. The ward gain is really nice. The wheel. Is it profane veil or wheel? I never know that. I'm not a native speaker. Speaker. I think we might have to drop the health leech items. We'll see. I, mean, I can't do it yet. So we have to fight Majesta like that. Just turn everything into a blood fest down here. Oh, I can't, can't get out of there. I felt, I felt very bad. I was blocked, body blocked like crazy. This is also what the profane whale helps a lot with. Dodge body blocks. <clears throat> Might want to go for the Lich now here. Health. It's better than Lich's health. I think this is actually pretty good. Pick. All sorts of le health leech are converted to increase damage at 10 times. Ooh, maybe we keep our items then. <clears throat> Survival of the Cruel, great name. Wait, wrong direction. Foolish. Plus one to Anomaly. Do strike. Reperform. You kind of want to shadow these. Fetish. Isn't he a boss somewhere? What the word? Yeah, picking that thing on the profane wave was nice. It keeps me up on ward a lot. And it's pretty neat. Hey guys, stop blocking me. Be helpful. Wasn't that a boss here? Huh. What's here? Fetish. Matron of the Lynx. Okay, it died fast. I didn't even need to do anything. So I guess dodge rating would help us a lot as well. Because we dodge in the profane veil that gives us ward. Right? How's this work again? Um, profane veil. This one. You gain ward per dexterity when you dodge while in profane veil. Derision. Dodge rating is what? Probably not that high. 76. 
Yeah, not that, not that cray cray. Oh, hello, lady. Yeah, yeah. I don't think so. Wither before me. Or maybe I do find my death if I play a stupid thing like that. And I might. I gotta keep the fissure up all the time. Holy shit, that eats. That eats frames. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Interesting what? I can't understand you over all the explosions, lady. I don't know what you're saying. Like, why do I gain the ward so slowly? That's so good. Anyway. Come on. Majasa, let's see how we fare against her. Disgraceful. <laughs> Child. This is not rage. For millennia, the vessel maidens have died so you could live. Now feel the unending abyss of their despair. What, what are you doing? <sighs> Why don't you show our guest the torment that now fills you? <laughs> <laughs> Confront Majasa. That's a nice way of putting kill the fuck out of her. <clears throat> Let's see. I don't think I can kill her very fast. I think this is going to take a bit. We'll see. Didn't even do as much damage as I thought it would. Oh, but this does. Holy. Oh shit, I stood right in there like an idiot. Foul insect. Begun. Yeah, she keeps saying that annoyingly. Oh. What? oh, I still ran the fire. Okay, that was stupid. That was actually very dumb. No mind. Yeah, it's gonna take a bit. I hate that it pulls you back and you have to reload that whole thing. That's a bit annoying. Yeah, we die a bit too fast, but. Let's fire up our curses a bit more. Why can I not cast it? There you go. Holy shit, that was close. Again? Ow. No, no, 
Actually, we can do it quite well, but now it's going to be interesting. I don't think I can kill fast enough to skip the double shit. Actually, I can. <laughs> nice, okay. Worked. She almost did it. Well, turns out that Warlock does some good damage. Like, the curse buff in Profane Veil is truly insane. That does so much damage. Does she not drop items? There we go. Wait, nothing good? Are you kidding me? What is that shit? <laughs> I like her. I like her character. Majassa is dead then. Just as he promised. This would be so much easier if you had died with her. No matter. I can still take what I need. You think this is over? Ha ha ha, shut up. Shut it, lady. Shut it. Okay, we can go to the Monoliths now. We've done all we needed in the campaign. Welcome back. Uh, I'm the... No, farewell, traveler. Stay safe. This dude looks fancy. Look at him. Oh, he vanished. Couldn't be bothered. So, let me think. First, let's put these here. Um, two handers. Wait, I'm already running out of two hands space. Fuck. Like the critical strike multiplier. I can't even afford a new stash tab. Feels bad. So. <clears throat> I guess we keep the leech for now. Because of what we get from this. Health leech shown to increase damage. Health gain on kill is not a leech door, is it? Yeah. So we will eventually exchange this item for another one. I still want to have a fucking two-hander scythe. Something cool. But this is just very bad. It's just very bad. This is also very bad. There is no cool two-hander scythe, is there? It's cool if you ever go for a fire warlock, which we will do eventually at some point. Plus five to attributes. Oh, this is the runic thing. This is the torment warlock. Which we're not running. Stormbreaker. Minion fire damage. I gotta run some fire minions as well. Huh. Cool things we can do. What's this shit? Lethal concentration. Any damage? Eh. This one wasn't bad. A lot of health, physical penetration with bleed. Chance to bleed a melee hit. Actually, this is very good for us. Also, cold resistance. That's pretty much exactly what we want, isn't it? But it's a fucking sword. I wanted to run a scythe. You know, for the style. Oh. We have a lot of good stuff for the fire warlock. Other than that, not so much. A lot of physical damage. I mean, we could turn this into a good thing. It's a lot of melee damage with 2 LP on it. Physical damage. This is actually the bad one. The other one is better. Oh shit, space. 
Hold up. This one. Has a stun chance for an armor on hit. That's much better. Bone scythe. Eh. Eh. We'll see. Uh, why do you need to talk to you? I've done monoliths already. What are you talking about, lady? Just to skip to, to get this thingy? Just for that? Come on. Come on, I, I even killed Formosas already. What are you talking about? I've been here before. Now it's Raye, I believe. The our next friend. Oh, we didn't even... No, no, no. I was talking shit. This wasn't the other character. I didn't even kill for Moses. Okay, never mind. I was talking trash. All good. <laughs> All good. But I killed the Abomination. It's good because you have a prophecy for... What should we call him? Uh, the Frost Lich. I just, just clicked. That was so dumb, honestly, also. I saw it coming. Didn't do anything about it. Mistakes were made. Yeah, I gotta real, realize we're in the monoliths now, so I should be a bit more careful. <clears throat> Mistakes were made. Now! Yeah, whenever I cast the curses, I reduce the cooldown of the thingy. This does a lot of damage and it gives me a lot of ward. The synergies are insanely good. I will say that. Rawr. Whoops, I misclick. Doesn't matter. <laughs> what? Stop with the lag. Another reason why health gain doesn't do much to me is because we have bleed due to our scythe, our harvest. So I just lose all that health immediately. Yeah, but it will be turned into damage with that one passive spell. Just you wait. Just you wait. It ends here. You gotta cast the curses to reduce cooldown. Then you can do it again. You can pretty much cast Profane Whale most of the time then. I mean, it has a cool... Uh, it has a stack. Maximum, I think, of two. But I think I can scale more into that. Think. Oh, right, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> What's so funny, huh? Is it your death? Hello, friends. Shit, I fucked up. Yeah. His fucking stun ruined my life. I killed him, but it doesn't matter. <sighs> this was so dumb. He stunned me, so I casted Profane Veil instead of Fissure. Because I clicked Q and clicked 
W right away. What kind of bullshit, dude? <laughs> you have to hit both, and but you have to cast Fissure first, otherwise it sucks. That didn't happen, but that felt bad. Died right in boss, he died anyway, and I still didn't make it. Stupid. Anyway, let's run through this a bit faster then. How about that? It ends here. I should have dodged him. It ends here. George. Damn. I mean, it does shred pretty nicely. Need one more. Ooh. I can't get over how funny she she is about that. Your death has come. <laughs> All right, let's finally do this properly. Cast it on him. Dodge the stun. There you go. See, it's so easy. So easy. We were right there and we fucked up. Anyway, whatever. So, let's go with XP, I believe. It's the best. Tomes of experience. Help us the most. Verdant outskirts. Hello, friends. How oh, are we doing? Yeah, fucked up. Whatever, doesn't matter. Good enough damage. Phonic Fissure is really insane at this point. And yeah, the problem really is, I realize this now, because <clears throat> I inflict bleed on myself due to my skill. And that eats up all the health I gain from the health on kill, so it's kind of a counter synergy there. I need it for a sanctum here, but sure. Why does all I have a million times? I don't care about this dungeon. Where are you? I don't care. Okay, whatever. A quiver. Mm. Give me the XP.
Um, well, sucks. Let's go up here, I believe. <laughs> oh, it's this place. Yeah, the waves one. I really needed to cast that down, but it doesn't matter. There's always a lot happening on the screen with this build. Let's gain some ward here. Like, why does the ward go up so slow? Yeah, because I lost all the health. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, does the bleed? Yeah, that's it. That's why it's all eating this shit. I understand now. The bleed also takes away ward, right? If I have bleed, it kills ward first. So the fact that I gain health is very detrimental to my survivability. Interesting. Very interesting. Because I go up in health, then I start to bleed. Because if Exanguinous, I would not bleed at low health. <coughs> Yeah, makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. We definitely need that one passive point. I haven't played the Burning Forest map in ages. I feel like. Yeah, see? That's... It's surprising to me that we survive regardless. Now we should be better because now we get that skill. Hold up. Or that passive point rather. This one. I can't do it because I need to put more into Lich. Fuck. Yeah, shit. Okay, we actually have to skill the Lich that far. Damn. You have to put 10 into this. I forgot. This we need. Health feature converted to increase damage at 10 times the value. And then I might actually have to switch items earlier. They currently leech health. Especially my weapon. As much physical damage as it does, which is nice, it gives me too much health leech. Oh, I have to change it anyway, I realize, because it's not actually... This is an ambush? Pretty funny. Get out of here. Um, it doesn't give me health leech, it gives me health on melee hit, I believe, right? Chance of bleeding, so I have no real use for that. So let's check. This is level 65, we are 61. Okay, I need a bunch more. more. More things. I can't even run this yet. What the fuck? Feels bad. What has physical damage? Physical. Only this guy? Really physical damage. <clears throat> Attack speed, strength. Oh, threshold, also good. Overkill damage leashed his health. Okay, that sucks. 
overkill damage, yeah. Yeah, this one of course. What is this? Melee physical damage, melee attack speed, increase main health. Armor shred. Can't run it though. Eulogy of blood. That sucks. The other way around would be nice. Your strength is equal to your intelligence. <clears throat> wow. This is actually very good for us. How do I never find any scythes? Scythes? Only this one. It's an axe. It's not even a scythe. This is I guess the sign is an X. But what the hell? How do I never find these? Why is this here? I was smoking crack then, I guess. This is physical damage? Oh no. Lightning. Let's ignite. Increase physical damage. I accept of static. Ooh! Chance of bleed on melee. This one is very good. Chance of ignite on hit. Probably better than this one. Because I don't want... Yeah, it's even more physical damage. So hold up. Oh, it's pretty much the same. Chance to bleed as well, and bleed duration, this is very good. What else we want to throw on it? Critical strike multiplier. Melee crit chance. What's our critical strike chance anyway? Critical strike multiplier is 200%, melee critical strike 17. That sucks. Melee crit. What's your potential left? Four percent? So each thing only gave me four percent? What is that bullshit? Oh, the chance is multiple. Okay, yeah, that's why we have 31 now. You can't even see this, but we are at 31% melee crit chance. Okay, I see. Yeah, I think we have to... It sucks with this axe because it kills my style. But whatever. We have a lot of twing items at this point. Also, I don't want the leech from this, so we go with other gloves. Which ones, though? I found some gloves earlier, didn't I? Physical damage. Oh, they all have physical damage. Huh? Wait, no, why does it not work? Damage? Why does the filter not work? the hell? Why does it not work? This sucks, man. It works now. Okay, thank you. It doesn't work on the glass for some reason. Wow, that's stupid. Why not? What a stupid bug. Actually, let's report this right away. So let's report a bug. Um, text search in stash tabs sometimes doesn't work. In this case, on the exalted gloves. Gloves? It didn't highlight them properly because they get the player data so they should be able to figure this out themselves what happened in the logs so i just look at this myself that's stupid minion damage intelligence and low resistances it's not bad 
strike, bullet resistance, damage over time, and armor. Okay, leech. Damage over time is strength, poison resistance. Eh. Stun chance. Health region. Ward gain and potion use. Uh, increased area of area skills. Health region, come on. Come on. Resistances or more damage? I think resistances. Physical, we have enough. Breach rate multiplier also helps us with our bolts, I realize. I mean, this is bad, better because it gives plus 3 to our attributes, but I hate the melee damage leeches health. What we could also do is we have these, right? Maybe that's a better one. Mana, health region, fuck that. Ward gain and potion, frailty on hit, physical resistance. Dexterity actually gives us more dodge rating. Maybe these are better. Let's put these in here, we don't want that. Health region, armor. Minion health is useless. Stun chance, strike avoidance. It only gives plus 2 to an attribute, though. Plus five? Okay, we want this one. Yep, that's better. Sorry, I wasted everyone's time with the gloves here. It's fine. He's actually pretty good. The swaddling of the raised. Same with the boots. You can use them quite often. So now we don't have any health leech. Because we don't want that. Right? If I'm not mistaken. Oh, poison damage leech is health. Okay, so this one sucks as well. Alright, we need an offhand. Spot. Symbol of Demise. 11 intelligence, 23 wall per second. Oh, yes. Level 80. Come on. All retention, ward gain on kill. This is good. The wall is consumed, granting a stack of Demise per 13 ward consumed. Lead chance. Oh, yeah, this is just exactly what we need. For these two we need, but this is level 80, that's gonna take a while. Our channeling. The other offhands that are good. That's relics. Does it work now? Wait, it's off minus hand catalyst, right? Oh yeah, there we go. It works again for some reason. Damage over time. Maybe that's it. Dead. Damage all time, spell damage, dodge rating. This is better. Yeah. Minion damage, critical. I can't run the other ones. Minion damage. Crit. I can't even run these. What the fuck? This one. Oh, this one's pretty good. Um spell damage. Sh oh shit. We need we need some high level. But this one's very good, okay. Offhand. Rock mind, you go in here. 30 intelligence. Damn, 4.6k. See? You don't always need the insane uniques. We're actually better off now with two exalted. Exalts. I still need the fucking health idols. I can't find them. The harvest does a lot of damage now. Why did this not scale so much with physical damage? And damage over time. This should have scaled insanely. Weird. Hmm. Anyway. I think we have a good setup now. I think we're good. All 17 waves. Oh, it's this place. Yeah. 
Gosh, I sh should survive better now. I feel like. Why is it lagging like crazy? What the hell? Like, I'm dropping frames insanely. What the hell? Dude? Bro, why am I out of mana? I guess I had some insane mana region on one of these items, huh? This then is another problem we gotta fix, okay. We gotta go for mana region then. Where did you get all that health from? What happened? I mean... Oh boy. I just mentioned that this build has issues with mana. So we gotta look into the mana region later. But yeah, we can see we're not constantly on more vault than we were before. Because we're not bleeding anymore. That's that's the key thing. I want to get out of this area because it eats my frames alive, dude. Descendants, thank you very much. Ooh, finally back with some frames. Let me check. What did we run earlier that gave us mana region? That's not it. We had the rot mine, right? Do a time with spells? No, that's not it. Was it really the the weapon? No, where did we gain so much mana from earlier? The fuck? Oh wait, maybe it's in the rock mind. In the implicit. No, it's just more mana, but not not crazy. Melee attack speed, of course, was an idea. Why was I sitting on such shitty mana earlier? What's up with that? Why is my ping ass now as well? Anyway. Let's proceed. Let us proceed. Charge. Yeah, see, that item changed there, did a lot, a lot to our build. I like to our survivability. You are beneath my skill. Yeah, shut up. Power, We're gonna kick your ass later, so don't you worry. Don't you worry, friend. Where is the other golem? There he is. Eat this. Teach of forward was easy. Unique idols. We want to have idols for sure. It's also more experience. Give me the idols. For sure. Oh no, these assholes. Get over here, friends. Hello? There we are. Sitting at 2k ward. Change. I hate these assholes. They kill you so fast. 
The build is coming alive, you'll love to see it. Now I don't even necessarily need that. What's it called? I can't go through here, what the shit? The passive point that turns leech into damage, because I don't have any leech anymore. Or well, not much anyway. Except them. Frozen Isle. Mm, it's not even a good one. Like, whatever. Okay, eat this. Yeah, this we don't even need yet. So let's proceed more in the warlock, I feel like. We can go for damage now. And this one I don't even want, I feel like. Necrotic skill, because... I mean, these are still necrotic skills. But well, this one isn't. Oh, they're all physical. This one's necrotic, yeah. Because... Within 50 meters have a combined 20 cha stacks of more damned, you chain all damned enemies to the ground. I don't care, they die fast anyway. More damned, I guess, which is not bad. I don't feel like I li really need that. I might want to respect that. Stop with your bullshit. I can put multiple st stacks on plague on people, right? I can't. So. What's this guy? Shut up. One kill, that's not a bad one. I want both these and that, and whatever the fuck. Let's get the idols first. If I could ever get good ones, I mean, I could run prophecies as well. I just realized. Also, why have I not seen any exiled mages? On top of that, perish. Freeze rate multiplier. Oh, destroy them. Destroy them. Oh, yeah. A stash. I haven't seen that in a while either. Legends health. Crits. Crits. Crit is always nice. Because everything crits. Your spells, your hits. You might want to go for this also on this build a little bit more. Maybe. We'll see. But damage over time is really our best. Damage dealer. Stop blocking me, you bitches. Not cool. Oh, no, not this one. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, that was stupid. Where is... Oh, this is going to be an ambush map, isn't it? Ruby Captain Arani. Ar Arjani. He's just chilling there, randomly. Perish. 
pathetic. You the pathetic pet. Shut up. See you dead. You all dead already. <laughs> Wait, that was the ambush? Oh, that was pretty laughable. Melee cold damage is nice. I don't have space for that though. That's very annoying. But it's two to dread shade. Oh yes. Oh yes, please. Health on kill, ward on push, use and mental resistance. Why are these all bad? It's a bleed on cold hit, critical strength avoidance. But for primalist, chance of gain 30 ward when hit. Sophie's spell damage one low. Eh. Critical strike chance, fire damage. Why does my loot filter rule them out? Poison on hit. Ward on potion use. Plague on hit. Chance to cast an avalanche bolt and a nearby enemy on melee attack. <laughs> I mean. Damage of rib blood. Where is the one with health? Acolyte, large idol that just says health. Duration for profane veil. Yeah, my loot filler is a bit fucked up there. But oh well. <clears throat> Running out of space again, aren't we? Alright, them boots. Uh, one hand. Uh, I still can't put this anywhere. It's all full. But melee cold damage is really good. What else do you want to drop? These are also good, man. Oh, and we have this. Well, that's more. So get the fuck out of here. <clears throat> we don't need this later, I feel like. This. Why do I have this here? Why? Do you even want to farm the set item? It seems like a waste. It probably sucks. They always suck. Don't they? They're just bad. Mm, whatever. Indeed it has. Oh, ho, ho. Uh. why are we so? S oh, they all have slow. That's why I was gonna say, why am I so fucking slow? What's going to say? What's going on here? Oh, nice. Level up on all the skills. All of them. So. Spirit Plague. We could make this one out. Bleed. Do this first. Profane veil. Negative elements and even you into profane. This is actually also not bad. Unholy renewal. I don't know if this is any good. I don't. Oh, this gives me more uses. It's four. That might be not bad actually. This might be not bad. Uh, we wanted to go for, I believe this, 
Yeah, spirits more frequently. Oh yeah, the cold stuff. High chance of freeze enemies prone. For one percent uncapped cold resistance. Deal more physical damage over time for four percent uncapped cold resistance. Here now we can go into cold resistance to do even more damage. With this little node, this little node does a lot of damage later. It's kind of crazy. Kinda crazy. Forest. What do we want to go for here? Do we want that? When Harvest hits a target afflicted by a Spirit Plague, it applies Withering and has a chance to spread Spirit Plague to an additional target. Yeah, if only I could put Spirit Plague on things. This buff does not stack. Stacking on two into this. I might like this as well. Ward when you when it hits a cursed enemy. Mind harvest. I can already do it. Do we go for that? No. Don't care. Argentum Spire. This guy should be quite easy. It was very easy with the paladin, that's for sure. This might take a little. This guy, this lance will make me a god. I keep saying this bullshit. The lance's power is, is exhilarating. exhilarating. Hello, friends. Death will not take me. Death will not take me. Low mana now. Holy shit, I almost fucked up there. Ruh. Let's gain some ward back. And mana as well. Where are you, sir? Then Raya. Yeah. Oh, I got a hit with the What are you to a god? Oh shut up. With the harvest because we have the kill threshold, this right? Will make me a there it is. Just a, a human. just a human. Because we instantly kill everything under 10% health, I believe. Quiver, helmet. I like helmets. I'm lacking good helmets. You're just human. I'm supposed to be again. I have three times now. Well, doesn't hurt. Doesn't hurt. It was actually easier than with the paladin because the paladin, while it is absolutely impossible to kill, like our healing hands, paladin, it doesn't do any damage. So <laughs> that's a problem. I might want to go for the gold instead. Oh, and an exalt mage finally. It's been a while since I met one of you guys. Stop running from me, you bitch. Because that progresses my prophecy. I have no space for any exalt mage items, though. It's not a problem. I'm so hungry, what the fuck? But see, ooh. Now that we changed our items, we don't run into any health issues anymore. It's 
Pretty nice. Wither before me. Crimson Scorpion. Was easy. We do run into mana problems, though, admittedly. It's all not that good. It's not that good. You run into mana problems. This is maybe where the lich helps. Oh yeah. Yeah, I should do this. Okay, we gotta do something real, real quickly. Let's go to our lady and respec. A little bit. Not too crazy, just a little. Hmm. Hello, Traveler. Uh, yeah, we don't need this yet, honestly. It has health, but... We don't need that. We also don't want this. I don't like it. Everything else, I think, is fine. Why am I not actually taking into this? Ward gain on kill? Ward DK threshold? Oh, this is actually great later, when you would be channeling, channeling. Yeah, we need mana region, so we put them glitch and a little bit more wall DK. I want to max this out. This is very good. Dum, 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 dum. This is for Moses, right? I believe. Right, where are we down here? Tones of experience, of course. Bleak Steppe. Fuck a shield. Where do we need to go? There it is. Okay. Ah, oh, the frames, the frames, or the lack of it, rather. Why is this? Your death is coming. Nothing else? What? I am on ending. I don't know about that. You can put that to the test. Wow, we're lagging. Like frames. Frames lagging. 
What are you guys? Where are you all coming from? Oh, from these things. I see. Not interested. Don't care. I can't go through here. Feels bad. <laughs> oh, I went the wrong way. No. No. There you go. Wow, what just happened? Yep, you're dead. Oh, not the scorpions again. I keep fucking this up. No, I didn't mean to pick that up, but whatever. Let's get out of here. Fucking laggy area. So, I have to take a call in three minutes, but I will keep playing. Um, but yeah, all good. So, pretty good shrine. You got wrecked it. I lost the wizard's cash. Oh, physical damage. Eat this. Unrelenting drawn visage of the shadows. Great name. Holy shit. They get destroyed. I can really cut down the... The cooldown on my fissure. Uh, on the... Profane Veil. Um, yeah, I'm out of here. Why? But I don't think we need more than two points in that. Because it can't really make it that much faster. Not really. Oh, it's this place. Yeah, I remember. Get out of here, lady. <laughs> Sash of hope. Yeah. Safe travels. Safe travels, indeed. So much water already. Things are going nicely in this regard. Leave. I forgot to cast my curse like a plague on it. You really should do this. It does a lot. Get out of here. Mana region still could be better.
Just ignite. Okay, I'm gonna be muted for a bunch of minutes, but I keep playing and I will be back.
All right, we're back. Sorry, but it's all good. Play enemies to lure them. Okay. Vitality. Mm, sure. Rah. <laughs> I'm thinking if we should even go for the critical strike. I mean, it does help, of course, because higher crit chance also applies to spells to an extent. Because it is physical. So it can crit. But I don't know. Maybe damage over time is just better. There's the ambush, huh? Also laughable ambush, please. I wonder how this this weapon does. This is a lot of a lot of health as well, which means more ward. Always neat. Always very neat. Much more of worship. You might find some good idols here. Really lightning them. Ooh, that's a lot of crit. Hitting effectiveness. Wrath to summon the flame wrath and health. I mean, it's it's okay. What else we got? Health on kill. Mm, 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 mm. Setting up tendrils. Full damage over time. It's not bad, but it's not crazy. Not bad, not crazy. Just just mid. Much of time for minions. That's a shitty one, isn't it? We also gotta farm some gold, man. For these stash tabs. You see, it actually casts Ripple out there. I think it's Spirit Plague that does it, right? There's a mage. That's good. I ah, fucked up. Anyway, it didn't matter. Oh, prophecy progressed. <clears throat> I think this was the exalted ones. Yeah. Let's reflect to attack us. That's not very good. <clears throat> Ghost flame. Ooh. Ooh. I think. I just think it. Wait, the prophecy. Oh, it just progressed, right? No oh, god, which one was it though? Child mage thingy, that is. <clears throat> um, this one over here. Plus three to ghost flame. If you would go for this, it could be nice, which we don't. But I like the physical res and the damage over time increase. Better than fucking crits. In the build they run this with crits, but I don't know. What if you do this? Fancy. Also, I, I forgot. Why are we not running this? That's much better, isn't it?
I mean, because crits don't apply to damage over time, right? It's really just the base damage. So I think damage over time is just better. Like, we are full dot warlock. Why would we go for crits? As I said earlier, crits are generally never a bad thing, right? Because everything can crit. But if you have a dedicated damage type, which is... In this case, should have fucked up. I meant to cast a thingy. Which is in this case your damage over time, which cannot crit. Then I think it's a bit different. Dark Ascent. Oh, it's this, this one. I feel like Royer should also be quite easy. Oh. Fuck. Fuck well off. <laughs> Don't run from me, get over here, friends. Let's build this some real damn damage. Damage. Yeah. <laughs> Set of legions. The rings you can pretty much always take. When they drop from your little field. Nice, we can run our item. See how that does. And we lose um, physical damage, right? <clears throat> a lot, actually. But we bleed a lot more on hit. Oh shit, yeah, it's probably not even the play because we can't run both of these. Hmm. It gives us physical penetration, bleed chance, and fizzress. Oh, melee damage leeches health, so it's not even good. Shit. Nah, it's not good. This is just better, these two. <clears throat> Because it gives us a leech again, which we don't want. What's cool is the health makes us tanky as fuck. And cold resistance in the implicits, which is also good with our Cephonic Fissure. But meh. Also, I think I thought they fixed the issues where some. Enemies don't have health bars, and this still isn't really applying. Well, that was not really a problem, was it? Very easy. It's a lot of crit chance. What? A lot of crit. 
Yeah, this item sucks. This is another health leech shit we don't want. Ah, oh, shit, I'm also running out of space here, huh? Feels bad. Acolyte idols, mage idols, tall idols, idols, jewelry. This one. Pretty nice, but I don't have space. I gotta carry it around until I can actually use it. Feels bad. Feels bad. Mm. Okay, until I can put it in the stash. I mean. Pretty dark in here. Going the wrong direction, or what's going on here? Fuck. Oh, there it is. Okay. Shut up. Plus two to dredge eight. Pretty nice. Some vault has zombie. Pretty nice to get these. Pretty neat. More ward. Yep. It'll be tanky AF. AF. Let's go. What? Why well, are we lagging again? What's up with that? I guess it got fixed already. Good. Saw the Merophage again. Again, I have this like five times or something. I don't know. Melee physical damage. Get out of here, man. That's... Eh, we have this enough, really. I feel like... Let's kick Reyes. Oh, we're gonna go play this. For sure. I mean, it's not in part, so it's probably not gonna give us great shit. But whatever. Because it's the betrayer. Opal Ring of Purity. Opal. What a pal. Not your buddy, pal. <laughs> Death will not take me. Yeah, relax. 
you're playing around with death a lot if you're so afraid of it taking you. Come on. There you go. <laughs> I will say this build is really super easy. Not even the bosses have been a problem mostly. Especially since we, if we fixed our items. So don't kill ourselves. Let's do this first. I want to have the unique or sad helmet. Might be shitty. We'll see. I need to fight these, honestly, but right? whatever. Just want to get to the helmet fast. There he is. It was easy. Free LP, that's very good. Oh, I wanted this for so long. That was a good drop. Prism shots, yeah, but this one, free LP on it. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. All right, let's kick Raye. Raye. The ruins of Solarum. Raye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, friends. Necrotic damage. What? Pick it up, man. Alright, we'll see. Why did he skip right away? Ow. You call me pathetic? You're almost dead. I think I dodge everything when I'm in the fissure. Is it not the case? Oh, damage over time effects. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's why we lost. Okay. So I can't dodge these. I have to run past them. Because I was getting time rot, I think, a lot. Like white, uh, what's it called? It's time rod, yeah. Like... Let's go man up. But he was still pretty easy. That's just fucked up. I thought I can dodge this. The veil. Apparently I can't. Oops, I fucked up. Damn, that did some damage. That did some real damage. Why, be 
I ran right into that. Ow. That was stupid. Doesn't matter. We're good. Under ten percent, come on, kill him. There we go. That's come on, chill a little. Running damage leashed. No. Watch rating. This shit. I don't even want it. Was on to teleport? To reblood? I mean. These are good to destroy. I know, Raya has been a bitch. Mostly. Real bitch. Blood, frost and death. Frozen woodland. Oh ho! Oh, this blood spot did no damage. Interesting. <laughs> Blood spot. No more. All right, let's max out our tankiness. And then we go for more damage. Poison damage. That's not bad. No more. I don't know what these guys are doing all the time. Are they like casting something on themselves? Like a circle jerk? I couldn't even see my mouse. Too, too many visual effects. Glyph of Despair. I still haven't found the Temporal Sanctum key, I just realized. I have one. Right? I believe. So let's first go over here. Actually, it's a two-hander, right? Yeah. This is insane. It's like a build. Much better than this one. After these too many times anyway. It goes into helmets. Yeah. Armor. Ah oh, shit, I need so many. I need so many stash tabs. See, this is also full. The one hand is also the easiest to carry around. I don't know if I like this. So much more damage over time. And armor. Vitality, health, physical resistance. Hmm. Mm hmm. Jack keys. We have one. Actually, we have two temporal sanctum keys. What we want to build, though? Yeah, this one just is ass, isn't it? Last steps of the living. Actually, we can just run the... Yeah, let's run the dungeon. 
Yes, why not? We can still... We can, might not even be able to do this, but we can make better twink items. Because we want to run a higher tier on that. Let's do it. I like the dungeon. Well, I don't like the dungeon, but the rewards it gives. Level 80. Can we even do this? We are 66. Can we even run that? We might just die like a bitch. Also because we have zero, literally zero, void resistance. And that's a problem against Jura, of course. Why is it jumped so high? Feels bad. Let's run another dungeon then, I feel like. How about the soul file? Lightless armor? We can also do this. Doesn't really matter. Yeah, I'm not interested. Wait, do I lose the key this way? No, it just stays in there with my warlock, right? I think the chat 75 let's try it. I feel like we can do this just fine yeah looks good to me maybe you can't even do the level 81 I mean, my melee doesn't do much damage, I will say that. But the Kephonic Fissure kicks ass pretty heavily. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Why is it never a fucking good one? Oh god. <clears throat> Metaphysical. This is all not very good. It's all not very good, gentlemen. Oh, what the? Oh, it's in the crowd damage from these guys. Yeah. That's it. Makes sense. This one is not a problem. Yep. Okay, we gotta be a little bit more careful. I don't have space for that. But I should also gain... Oh, this guy. Gotta dodge this. We should also gain a lot more XP in here. I feel like... That was a waste. We need some mana. I feel like it's left. I don't know why. So we'll see. Uh oh. We gotta dodge this guy. Fucking necrotic damage. Ooh, spell damage for curses. Since I'm mostly running on the fire shield, this uh, necrotic damage is always a pain for me. You might be able to do the dungeon, like the temporal dungeon, on level 80, just fine, but the boss is the problem. Jura. Because of the fucking void damage everywhere. Huh. 
it on. Hmm, sure. Why not? Ooh, it's a lot of mana region. It's pretty neat. Oh, damn, I almost fucked up. He needs to die. Fast. There we go. What the? Dude's just jumping around, what is that? What is up with that? Is he still alive? What's that trash? Oh, it's two of them, huh? Throwing physical damage? Could be good for the rogue. I don't even have space for it, I just realized. Definitely did increase... Oh, there it is. Nice. Definitely did increase the picking up shots speed. Did well on that. Improved performance on that. It's good. Okay, this should be easy. Not with that. Uh, we'll see. Come to play with fire. No, I fucked up. Yeah, no, if, if we fuck up like like that, then it's not easy. Actually, it's fucking easy, isn't it? The fire, that was actually very easy. The boss liked it. Fire, I could have had LP on this, please, for once. Anyway, um... Yeah, the mobs in the dungeon were more difficult than the boss. I'm, I'm gonna say it. It's just what it is. I didn't even get much soul ember. Fancy a deal. Fantastic work. Soul embers. Fucking rare? Are you kidding me? Why does he never have swords? It's so weird to me. Unique. Exanctionist with LP on it. Or this with LP on it. Also didn't happen. You bitch. Unique. Uh, come on. Ooh. I want to destroy this. And slapped is on some other thing. Well spent. Fantastic work. Formosus will Formosus. With delight when I give him my report. Now about These weapons are all ass. Care to let me see your whole friend? Um yeah, relic. Oh god, a rare relic. You can keep that, man. I'm not interested. This was it, huh? Soul Furnace. Ah. Um, what are we running now? No, I didn't mean to pick that shit up. Get it out of here. It sucks anyway. Belts. A hat. And a spell damage for curses. Pretty nice, actually. Oh, shit. No space. They don't hit. Damn, don't hit. Also not bad. This one's pretty bad. Actually, I could um, destroy that.
Was it this one? Nope. Oh wait, no, never mind. They all suck. You just throw the sulfur bashing key down there. What's wrong with me? <clears throat> that was insane. Why did it not do it? Mana region. We need the cold resistance. We need that. Oh, oh god. No space. Well, we don't have to space, you have to do it like that. Mm -hmm. We could even run it at tier 3, to be honest. Whatever. Last refuge. Oh, I'm not even here yet. Okay. Susan, because we're going to end the stream in 15 minutes anyway. Ish. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So let's go to the Shrouded Rich and to the Lightless Owl. I don't know if we can do it on stream. Hopefully. We'll see. I haven't played this dungeon once with this character. What the hell? What's up with that? Yeah, this chest sucks. Oh. Just let me pass, all right? Stop annoying me. Damn, it does so much damage. I should be able to get through this fast because I think I know where I have to go. Straight away. So we'll see. Yeah, yeah, no, not interested. Oh, we have tier 2 already. How is that? I haven't played this one. Interesting. Does it depend on my level? Maybe. You guys, Beetle. Hello, friends. Oh, lots of mana. That's neat. Uh, actually, you want to go here? Eh. Another one. Ow. Melee Creek is trying. Oh, it's also not bad. It should be somewhere here, I believe. Shut up. Shut your whole mouth, man. Some of the top left, maybe? I don't know. The condenser is different every single time. For me, anyway. It feels like that. Holy damage. I mean, it could everything, but that was some damage. It's close. Closer than I wanted it to be. Mm, left or right? What do you think? I guess right. Maybe. It's not here. It's bad. Ooh. 
wither before me. Ah, come on, it's on the right, is it? Doesn't look like it is. Uh, we're going the wrong way. Yep. It's on the left. Feels bad. <laughs> right all the way into the wrong direction. Nothing new in this dungeon. Because it sucks. Uh, for minions, it's not even that good. Ah, all the way in the wrong direction. Classic. Classic. Come on. Uh, I maxed this one out, so I think we now go for more Lich. Mana region intelligence, yep. We don't need that. Holy fuck, it's able to kill this. Thank you. The end boss will be tough in dodging all the damage the first part. The second I never find to be that difficult. Like when you actually add the heart, the Titan's heart. The first one dodging the, the things he throws at you, that's, that's the bullshit. Alright guys, you can have it. Get wrecked. Oh, it's not good to stand in all these guys while they do their dance. Whoops. The poison! The poison damage. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Not here, apparently. Damn, what's with all these bats? I think my ambo died already. Huh? Oh, there we are. Nice. Already at the boss. Good stuff. Alright, then let's see. <coughs> it ran right through the second wall. No problem. I have no ammo on that. It doesn't really matter though, does it? Alright. Please destroy this wall fast. Okay, it takes forever. Why is it taking so long? Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh! Yeah, this one I need to dodge next time. This is insane damage. I can dodge it with the profane veil pretty well though, can I? We already killed it? Okay, we did. If I could cast my spells, that would be nice. I would enjoy that. Now we have to dodge his shit. Actually, that was too soon, wasn't it? Okay, we did this. Now let's see. Oh, that was so close. Boy, that was much closer than I thought. 
almost fucked up at the end. <clears throat> almost. Damage over time. Spell crit. Dodge. Medical. Ooh, we almost fucked up there. Almost. I didn't even want to do this. Oh, idols. Probably sucks. I'm not interested. Yeah, I don't care. I want to do it. <clears throat> All right, so this one's actually also pretty good, isn't it? Oh, fire damage. Should 16 intelligence, though. 16. Oh, shit. We're running out of space everywhere. Gloves. I don't have two handle space. It's not, not even good. Armor. Looks bad for us. Mana. It's not even that insane. And the belt. Level 80. That takes a while to get there. I don't know if this is actually better. I don't know. Anyway, that's it for today, gentlemen. That was a lot of fun. As always. Uh, I've been here already. Yeah, never mind. Um, I'll be back on Tuesday. I don't know what we play. Warlock. Maybe our Paladin. Maybe we even start a new class. We'll see. I kind of want to play some more Warlock though. I don't think I'll make a build guide on this yet. Because there's some things to still figure out. Because we don't have all the spells yet. The spell levels. So maybe there is some things I'm going to go with. But I will definitely make one on this at some point. Uh, next one's going probably going to be the Paladin. I'll make a build guide. Actually, I'll upload now or later. Um, the Frost... Frost Wrath Lord guide. This one is insane. 700k crits. That's a good one. So yeah, see you on Tuesday with better internet also. Higher stream quality, no lags. I'll see you there, gentlemen.